All right, here we go with Topps 93 Series 1. So hopefully we find this guy in here. And as a gold card, that would be absolutely beautiful. Well, let's, let's, let's find out. 93 Topps. You know, a lot of these cards of the Stars and Hall of Famers are worth money in, in a 10. Like a PSA 10, but otherwise not much. Look at this. Got cards flipped around. Nowadays we know that might actually mean a hit, but back then not so much. So let's try to figure this out here. Here we go. Hey, the gold is Barry Bonds. That is not too shabby right there. Hell of a car. Of course, this has a little ding right here, of course. Well, can't, uh, whatever. Great car, but unfortunately has a, a, a blemish. All right, Galarraga, big cat. Rene Gonzalez, Mickey Morandini, Randy Velarde, great utility player. I'm sorry, decent utility player, not great. I don't want to throw that word around. Mike Jackson. Got Jack Morris here. It's kind of weird. It looks like there's something missing there, but I think it's the top of the stadium. So just the way the picture is. Chris James. Mike Moore. Chuck Knobloch. The Yips. Oh, well, he's World Series champion, but yeah, unfortunately the Yankees. Hey, look at this. Wade Boggs. Another uh both these guys would go on to win rings with the Yanks. Wade Boggs, Hall of Famer, great player. Hated him as a kid, loved him in the 90s, obviously. He was playing for my team. Brian McRae. Pete O'Brien with the glasses. Rob Scanlon, sorry, Bob Scanlon. We finish out with Mike Butcher. All right, so Bob, our gold card was Bonds, not bad, and got a Wade Boggs there, so not too shabby.